Hello and welcome to Daily Devotions. Today is Monday, April 20th, and our theme for today is Remember. Our text is part of the Ten Commandments that uh, God gave to Moses up on Mount Sinai. So we're reading from Deuteronomy chapter 5. Remember that you were a slave in the land of Egypt, and the Lord your God brought you out from there with a mighty hand and an outstretched arm. Therefore the Lord your God commanded you to keep the Sabbath day. God gave the Ten Commandments to the people of Israel while they wandered in the wilderness of, of Sinai. Uh, life was a challenge, especially when they first entered into the desert. Uh, they had no water, no uh, food. They were completely dependent upon God for all of, all of their needs. And, and when they complained to Moses, they, when they complained to God, Moses said, but remember, remember that you were a slave in the land of Egypt and that God delivered you with a uh, mighty hand and an outstretched arm. And then 40 years later, when they were about to enter into the promised land, uh, once again, Moses said to the people of Israel, remember Remember that a, a wandering Aramean was our ancestor, and he went down to Egypt, and it was there that the Egypts treated us harshly and afflicted us, and we cried to the Lord, and the Lord brought us out of Egypt with a mighty hand and an outstretched arm. And God has continued to deliver God's people. And when we just think about the 20th century, God delivered us from the pandemic of 1918, and God delivered us from the Great Depression and from the crises of World War II. And God will deliver us again. God will continue to do that. Now, in our fear and our anxiety and our, our stress, sometimes our mind shuts down, and and we tend to forget. We tend to forget that God is with us, that God delivers us. And so it's helpful for us to remember. Remembering is a, is a very good spiritual exercise. We need to remember that God is with us and what God has done in the past and what God has promised to do in the future. Uh, there's a song that uh, hymn that I like, and, and when, I, when my mind kind of goes into a funk, I, I tend to remember this song. It, you recognize it. It goes, O God, our help in ages past, our hope for years to come. Be thou our guide while troubles last, and our eternal home. It's kind of a prayer, too. But, Pastor Becky, will you lead us in prayer? Absolutely. Let us pray. Eternal God, your love is stronger than death and your passion more fierce than the grave. Help us remember that just as you delivered the Israelites from the hand of the Pharaoh and delivered our nation from the pandemic of 1918, you will also deliver us from COVID-19. Help us to trust your promises of healing, help and deliverance. Heal those who are sick and protect those who care for the sick and provide essential services. Give wisdom to those making decisions about our future. We pray all this in Jesus' name. Amen. May God Almighty guard and keep you. The hand of God protect you. The angels accompany you. And the blessing of Almighty God, the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit be with you now and forever. Amen. Amen.